The best governor in the country is our governor. The person, the person who is the driving force, I know, for a lot of us, uh, for Barack Obama. So, I know he's on a tight schedule. I'm not going to have a big, long, flowery introduction. But I just want to say, a friend. A friend. <laughs> See, now that's a little bit of Mark Warner rubbing off on me. Right, his, his Excellency, a friend of every working family, not only in Virginia, but in this country, Governor Tim Kaine. Jimmy, Jim Levin, to Jim and to Doris, we could not, we wouldn't trade these guys for any state labor leaders in the United States, guys. What? to Larry and the other labor leaders who are here, um, I wouldn't be here for, for you. Uh, I was a uh, official in Richmond and started to work with labor when I was mayor. And, and uh, I ran as an underdog in a primary for lieutenant governor. You helped me win. I ran as an underdog in a general election for lieutenant governor. You put me over the top. I ran as an underdog for governor of Virginia. Labor put me over the top. We've been through some battles. We've been in some box schools. I come out of a family. My dad ran an iron worker organized welding shop. I know the power of labor. Great work, great training, safety, steadiness. That's why I've been I've been so happy to have your support, so happy to work with you. To all of you, give yourselves a big round of applause. You're changing the The electoral votes have been our holy grail. I mean, let's be honest. Let's be honest. We've been winning races, and they said, well, we couldn't win races if we showed them we could win governor's races. Then they said, we couldn't win federal races if we showed them we could win U.S. Senate races. But nobody, nobody thought we could be competitive and get electoral votes this year. But we're going to prove them wrong. Yeah, you